I'm here really to talk about D500. Uh, newly announced today along with D5, it's a 20.9 megapixel DX format CMOS sensor with no OLPF so you get the sharpness out of your Nikkor lenses. It uses the exact same autofocus sensor as the D5 does, 153 point with 99 cross type sensors down to EV minus four. It's 180,000 pixel RGB metering sensor. So your focus tracking and everything I talked about before with D5 is just as great as it is on, uh, with, with D500. It can shoot up to 10 frames per second and it uses XQD and SD cards in the camera. So if you, if you want a companion to your D5, it's a perfect companion. And if you want to step up from your uh, D300 or D90s or older cameras that use SD, you've got that ability as well too. Really, really cool. Both cameras for the first time, along with a new SB5000 speed light, will work with radio frequency control. And all you have to do is add the WR-810 and WR-R10 wireless transmitter, pair the speed light with the cameras, and you have total wireless radio control. And the really cool thing about it is, it works seamlessly with our current optical line of sight system. So you can mix and match optical line of sight and radio, or you can shoot specifically radio frequency control up to six groups, A, B, C, D, and F group. You can shoot 10 frames per second raw, and just like D5, you can shoot up to 214-bit images. Wait, say that one more time. Up to 214-bit images in raw or raw JPEG together with the camera and it's really, really quiet. 100% viewfinder accuracy, takes all of your Nikkor lenses, it takes FX, it takes DX, because it is a DX camera. And what's really, really interesting is that because you've got the same sensor, that full frame or autofocus sensor, the autofocus array almost takes up the entire viewfinder. Like the D5, it's got a touch capacitive LCD screen, but one of my favorite features, it's got a swing out uh, tilting screen and it's the first Nikon camera to feature Nikon's new SnapBridge technology using Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and uh, near-field communication, NFC. With Bluetooth, you have constant connection. So once you pair with the new Nikon SnapBridge app, you turn it on, you pair it with the, with the camera, you don't even have to have the camera on to send images to your, to your compatible smart device. So you can be put the camera in your bag, you can be on your merry way, images will be transmitting and trans transferring to your smart device seamlessly and with Bluetooth low energy. It'll send it up to the Nikon cloud real easily and um, it's going to be fun to transfer and show people and share through social media all the great images you get with a camera like the Nikon D500.